All right, our weather this week may impress you because we are looking at the warmest weather so far this year. We've got 80 degrees in the forecast for this week. Uh, for the first time this week, our earliest uh, that we've ever seen 80 degrees was January 1st, 2012. The latest we've ever seen it was April 6th, 1973. On average, we see our first 80 degree day on February 12th. That's when we look at the average uh, temperatures going all the way back to the 1890s. And so uh, when we look at just the last 20 years, it's actually closer to the end of January. Either way, we're beyond where we typically would see that. It's been cold the last 30 days. Here's an interesting bar graph of the last 30 days. There's a lot going on here. Let me break it down for you here. This red line, that's our normal high for this time of year in Phoenix. This is our normal low this time of year in Phoenix, this blue line. Our lows here shaded in green have mostly been below normal. Our morning temperatures have been chilly. We're not just being wimps about it. It actually has been colder than normal. And these are our afternoon highs. We had a nice little stretch here near the beginning of February. Remember that Super Bowl, the open, the WM Phoenix open where temperatures were nice, but Ever since then, we've kind of been up and down with some pretty chilly days. So that's about to change as we head into this new week ahead. 56 degrees our current temperature with winds out of the east at 5 miles per hour and a 40 degree dew point. The warm up here in the valley uh, is going to lead to melting snow in the high country. They've already started to release some of the water uh, from the SRP lakes down the Salt River. And so a flood warning is in effect here near the Granite Reef Dam between there and Tempe Town Lake. Unbridged crossings here until 2 o'clock today. At the same time, this flood warning for the Tonto Basin continues to be extended. This uh, one is not uh, under control here uh, as it is over near the dam. This is going to become a, an issue ongoing here as we continue to see the snow melt uh, upstream here. So Con Tonto Creek right now uh, not crossable here and the flood warning has been extended all the way through the end of next weekend. Things are really going to get warm. I think we're going to see a really rapid snow melt for parts of the state by the weekend and we'll start this week, but especially this weekend because our weather patterns changing right now. We're quiet. We've just got some clouds moving in and a jet stream that continues to stay pretty active. But these next couple of storms as we go forward in time here, timeline at the top of your screen, all stay to the north of us. So we didn't have any more rain and snow in your forecast, and we're slowly going to warm things up to the middle of this week. Now, as we get toward the end of this week, particularly toward Friday, Saturday and Sunday, a little bit of a ridge starts to build here. Southwesterly flow promote some warmer air and that's when we think we're going to see our first 80 degree days of the year over the weekend ahead. We stay pretty quiet around here and dry our seven day rain out outlook really doesn't show much for Arizona. So of course that means no snow either for the high country highs today across our region in the 50s for Los Angeles and San Francisco upper 40s today in Portland 61 in San Diego and Santa Fe 27 up at Billings and Casper 39. That's it for Salt Lake mid 40s today for Flagstaff low 70s for the valley we will climb to the mid 70s for Tuesday, Wednesday and into Thursday. Here's our first 80 degree day of the year. It is on Friday and I think we're going to bump up to the mid 80s for next.